out Reagan Fox on Twitter and Rachel BB12. It's uh, wait, it's going back and forth together. It's Twitter Friday. Oh my god. Something. Wait, you guys. Wait, you're on Twitter. She's on yeah, Twitter. I'm on Twitter. Oh, what's your Twitter name? What's Rachel BB12. Rachel the real BB12. one. Rachel yeah, because we need because there's fakers out there. Right. I know. Okay. Yeah. I think okay. I've been tweeting the fake bitch. No. Yeah. <laughs> like I've been tweeting some Rachel somebody. No, and yeah, Reagan right? Fox is on. So you guys have been going back and forth on Twitter. Well, no, it's don't not. do that, no. girl. No, because you know what you do. You yeah. feed the fan. Yeah, yeah don't do that. Home. And then it's there for like time. Forever. It's yeah, like it's there, forever there. Don't. Well, yeah. you know she hasn't responded. I haven't. Yeah, I haven't responded. He's adding you. Well, yeah, we follow each other. Um, so I think what's going on right now is that Reagan's not coming to Vegas because, no, yeah, I know, and I'm pretty sure he's not coming because this is where I live supposedly. And no, we actually heard different. Oh, really? We heard that the reason why Reagan and Matt weren't coming is because they were clued in to the fact that Big Brother 11 and other past house guests from other seasons were going to start drama. So he was afraid. I mean, I don't know if this is true. Right, we yeah, don't know for sure. Excuse. But this is what we're hearing that he was clued in. I don't know if you guys heard the same thing because some, some other oh about the season well 12. people were just upset with him because all they did was talk about oh, the yeah, yeah 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 so season. that they were a little hesitant to come for that reason. I don't know if it's true. Um, I don't really know. don't see Reagan and Matt being hesitant to do anything. So I'm pretty sure. Who knows? Yeah, we I'm don't pretty know. sure that the they reason that Reagan really? and Matt was well, they're going to avoid Vegas because you are I know, Vegas. right? No, yeah. hey, no that's the question I want to ask. She is right? Vegas. Rachel, are you I Vegas? Am. I mean, she I am. Vegas. I love Vegas. Did you guys not know she's from Vegas? <laughs> um, we know, from wait, not only is she from, she is. Remember, I Brennan, I'm she from. She is. I am. Yeah. Not, yeah. What she's am not I? Do it, do it for us. Do it. Oh, God. Brennan, <laughs> I am quintessential Vegas. <laughs> That scene was so funny that, that you were like, serious, you're no, like, I am I think, I think for me, for me it was when Megan was feeding yeah. the line, she's like, well, if I wanted to go somewhere where I'd have lots of fun, where would I oh go? Oh my god, did you guys see that on live? No. no! What? You didn't see that Wait, what? Oh about. my god. So this is when Reagan and I were friends. So Reagan is like feeding me lines. He's like, Rachel, where would I go if I wanted all my dreams to come true? She, I was like, go to Vegas. If you want all your dreams to come true, go to Vegas. Yeah, and he's like, Rachel, what else about Vegas? I was like, oh, in Vegas, if you have a fantasy or a dream, all your dreams will come true. All you have like to do is go record. to Vegas. Oh, like, really, literally, yeah. it was the it was the yeah. funniest so thing ever. So he was, like, leading you. Yeah, like, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Totally. And then he's like, well, what can I do if I'm, like, want romance? I was like, go to Vegas. And <laughs> And you should like, be a spokesperson. You I should have been That's what we thought we were getting here. Hey, I know, right? <laughs> you should have a key to the city. I know. Well, Rachel, okay, I wanted to... You need to, to make a reel of okay. everything that you said about I'm Vegas. I'm Big Brother. And, seriously, <laughs> and send it. it to the Bureau. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> the Visitor's Bureau of Vegas. And then watch. We're going to see you on every billboard. Right? Oh, God. Hey. I've always wanted to know. The producers, you know, in the diary room. Yes. They, you know, they kind of coach. Not coach, but they kind of direct you away. No. Right? Oh, my God. We're revealing. Okay, you guys, he's the diplomatic one. They totally manipulate the game. Well, oh, so, <laughs> did they tell you to always say no one gets between me and my man? Oh yeah, did they tell you to was say that? that you? Well, yeah, that was me when it was with me and Annie because I was so mad at this point at Annie because I felt like she was manipulating Brendan okay. and. And so I was like, Annie, don't mess with me and my man. Nobody gets between me and my man. And then after that, it, it kind of became it it, yeah, it kind of they became a it. thing. But so did they tell like, you to Rachel. say it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Did you, oh I mean, they God. didn't know that. It wasn't like they didn't tell me to say it. But they it. would say, is anybody going to get between you and your man? And you'd be like, no one's going to get between <laughs> you and your man, right? <laughs> I mean, it's something like that. Oh, because it's <laughs> but, like you said it so many times. Well, yeah. It became and a I running really, joke with the fans. They're like, she's going to say it again. Yeah. And then when you said it with Andrew, you said it with Andrew. And I really meant it, too. <laughs> Don't mess with me, my okay. man. Now, we're speaking about you and your man. Yeah. Is it true that you, in fact, were hitting on Annie? The whole no. me and my man thing came from that. Was it true? No, no, no. And I even explained to her. Yeah. Like, Annie and I had, like, one night we had, like, a serious heart-to-heart. -heart. And see, again, this is the hard part because I really, I really liked Annie a lot. Like, uh -huh. I thought her I connected. And we had a lot of similar stuff in our past. And it was kind of an emotional night for us. Uh, when we were laying in bed together, like I put my, I even told Rachel this, I put my arm like around her, like around her waist, mm -hmm. and like we were kind of like more like consoling. I'm getting upset right now. I know, I'm, me I'm, too. I'm Thank you. I'm really upset too. I'm right a little now, uncomfortable right now, okay, to be honest. Whatever, whatever. You put her hand, your hand where? Like, yeah. <laughs> around, like around her waist. On her like, butt. We, we slept. No. <laughs> your waist, your waist. But it was more like just like consoling her as a friend. Because she said, she, I we got one interview question where somebody asked if I was hitting on her. I was like, if I was hitting on her, she would have known I was hitting on her. Oh. There would have been no question. So. Okay. Because well. you know that she maintains that story to this day. And I told Rachel exactly what it was. Let's be real here. I mean, he kind of got the better deal. <laughs> 
I did. I mean, and there wouldn't be a pretzel. There wouldn't be a pretzel. And that was the best. That that wouldn't have worked. Um, Mm -hmm. Granny. Granny. Granny sounds like somebody's old grandma. (laughs) Sounds like, yeah, the cereal, the granny. Brendan, what's your ethnicity? Your last name is like Villegas, right? Villegas. Villegas. I'm uh, Irish and Mexican. Oh. Okay. Do you speak Spanish? No, un poco, pero no mucho. Oh. So you can order a taco, basically. Yeah. You can get away with a taco. <laughs> or los tacos. I'm going to oh, okay. get him to speak <laughs> Spanish, though. Yeah. You, do you speak Spanish? No, but, okay. I mean, oh. well, a little bit. But I want him to learn it. Like, whisper it in your it, ear? Yeah, exactly. Okay, How so sexy would that yes. be, right? Yes. Yeah. Let's be real. Get and then, and then, and then she said, hi, papi. Yeah. Hi. Simone. Vatos locos forever. Aside from the bold and the beautiful, what's next for you? Um, I don't know. We have a Whatever. few things that we're can well, talking about, and hopefully the little we'll birdie out. told me you guys are going to be moving in together in LA. Hey, maybe <laughs> for real? What? Yeah. Um, we're hoping, hoping. Yeah, we're hoping. I can't leave Vegas for good, so I think I'm going to do part-time. I think part-time I'm going to have to wean her away from you Vegas. You are going to have little, to wean her off. Of little by little. Seriously, little by little. I I don't know how I'm going to leave Vegas. I love it. Yeah. Where's like the spot to go then in Vegas? Yeah, where um, are you taking us tonight? I <laughs> know, <laughs> seriously, you're Vegas. Seriously, so it's like, I. <laughs> I love Vegas, and I will say this because um, I love the Light Group. It's my favorite um, company in the world. There you go. It's official. Okay, that, yeah. Oh, she's going to take us Any to Light Group property. property. Okay. Yeah. 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 That'll be Jet, Hayes, um, Bay. Hayes is the new one in Aria. Yes. Yeah, oh, fun. okay. Well, yeah. we're going there tonight. Hey. 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 Hi. Come check us out at Hayes. <laughs> Okay, so what award are we giving them? Yes, Ooh, at the Pop Talk Web Show, Fun. we give out awards. That's how we roll, because you know what? We have a big budget. You know what I'm Here. saying? We give out hey. awards. Hey, I love Huge. that. And this award that we're giving to you, you've been nominated for most dramatic couple of the season. Yay! Yay. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank you. Thank you so Do you want to give a speech? Much. Do you want to give a speech? speech. Well, so I'd like to first thank my uh, mother for being me to be dramatic at a young age. Uh, my father for telling me to stop being dramatic and making me more dramatic. Rachel? And, uh, I don't know. <laughs> well, what do you want to see all the fans out there, the ones that are supporting you? So, thank you so much for yeah. supporting us. I really thought everyone hated us. Um, you know, I love the fans. If you guys see us out in public, please come up to us. We love pictures. We love signing things. Anything y'all want, and we just love the fans. Thank you yes. so much. And, and you're fun. And it was nice to get out and, and yes. finally hear that people did like us. It yes, was. at Vegas yes. Bash, you're meeting all these fans over yes. here. Yes. I know it's so fun. And I have you met Patrick fans. yet? Oh my God, I love Patrick. Oh, Patrick and is so he's all about oh the strong, confrontational right? woman. I did love you see him. his shirt? I saw it, Shima. And what is he saying? It says goddess and it's yeah. my face. And she must, and then he like is loves me too. I he love loves. It. He's like he's like, where's Rachel? He's like, Shima, I love you, but where's Rachel? Oh. Yeah, some people that really love you. I know. Yeah. Some and then some that really hate us. Oh, whatever. Though. And so we're gonna get you we gotta get you to do the no hate campaign. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna have to the no hate. Okay, no hate. After after the few comments that you made, you know, for uh, Reagan, the Queen oh. and the um what was the other? <laughs> the Reagan? The Reagan comments. Uh, so we're gonna oh, have to hook you up with that. Yeah. yeah, we're gonna yeah. have to hook you up with no hate. Thank you. you. You are familiar with the campaign with the duct tape? It's I'm not. An but LGBT I will. campaign, yeah. Yes. Definitely, then yeah. I'll do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I sure. am definitely down with the no hate. And I don't hate Because let's Reagan. clear it up, right? Yeah, let's do clear you, it up. Let's do Do you like up. the gays or do you hate okay, the gays? Okay, I love the gays and I. I mean, I have a lot of gay friends. I don't know how to even word this because every time I Wait, word but, it, see, Reagan yeah, that sounds horrible. It, it's yeah. like, that sounds, that's like, like I have black yeah. friends. Don't say that. I know. I don't even have a color. I don't know how, what to say, but I love the gays. Just say you love the gays like Lady Gaga would say. Yeah. You love the gays. I love the gays. And it's a misconception. And I, you know, I'm all about clearing up misconceptions and people, you know, yeah. falsely yeah. accusing you because you don't want to get that label. Right. So just Thank them. you. Thank yeah. you so much. I love the gays. I have no hate in my heart for them at all. I mean, right. there you go. I don't know what else to say. I love it. <laughs> and she's endorsed by Kevin. Hey! And I can officially say Yay! I'm not getting any negative vibes. <laughs> yeah, right? nothing at all. None, no, no negative vibes. No Thank negative you. vibes. <laughs> she's a sweetheart, guys. Yeah. Kevin and I are going to be besties, by right. the way, because he's kind of fabulous. Right, okay. <laughs> kind of? I, I mean, get, totally know, fabulous. Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> so your official Twitter is RachelBB12? RachelBB12. And yours is... Have you got one yet? What? Oh, come on! I know! I know. Oh, I know. We, the whole way over here, I'm like, Brendan, everyone wants you to Twitter. So you know you're yeah, going to have like, more fake accounts if you don't create one. Yeah, you need no. a free official your, one. Under too. Your, hopefully no one's taking your real name okay, now. You better hurry up and jump yeah, on that. Yeah, better jump on that. Yeah. It is 2000, motherfucking 10, and you guys are going to have a right. That's yeah. right. Do you have a Facebook? 
I do have Facebook. Yeah, <laughs> right? It's like, what are you flip flipping on me? Yeah. <laughs> Brendan actually still has MySpace, and that's all he has. I oh, have oh, my shit. Oh, my I did not have a MySpace. Yeah, to MySpace. <laughs> Come on, that was a low blow. <laughs> <laughs> Well, thank you so much for joining us. It's been a pleasure. Oh my God, thank you so much. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.